In this episode of Sailing Doodles, we get boarded while at sea. The girls play with some jellyfish. And I crash my drone in a beautiful paradise. We only had one night left on our sail around the Koh Chang Archipelago in Thailand. Thank you to our patrons. We could not do this without you. And thank you to Group Island Spirit for supplying the boat we're currently sailing. All right, Mateus is leaving now. He's been here over this couple days. We're a little hungover this morning, moving slow. I blame these guys. I blame her. <laughs> I blame her. Thanks yeah. for uh, coming well, by. Thanks for having good me. Good times, man. It was really good. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> so I dropped Mateus off on the beach, and we were ready to go. It's for the hangover, okay? In a, yeah. In a good circun circumstances, I could do it, but now I'm gonna. You help me, please. It's, it's difficult. I'm telling you. <laughs> Are you ready? No, I couldn't. <laughs> we are headed south. We're gonna go our last night at a little place called Kokam, Konam. And it's just not much there. Kind of a quiet, nice little chill evening, unlike last night. But anyway, we'll head out now. When leaving an anchorage on a catamaran, the first thing you need to do is unhook the bridle from the chain. With the anchor up, it was time to head out. What are you up to? It's hot. It's very hot. It's shade. <laughs> Do you think it's possible doing this while sailing? Yeah, it's fine. Okay. We were only moving at about six knots and the wind was from behind us at five knots, so the apparent wind on the boat was absolutely almost zero and we needed this shade. The little shade structure was specifically made for this boat and only took a few minutes to put up. Earlier in the morning, we had called Island Spirit to tell them we were having problems with our dinghy and they sent hey. a crew out to find us. Hey, how are you? Kim, Kim, tell me you have to pop up. The prop was slipping on the shaft and needed to be tightened down. Yeah. So it's, it's pretty cool. I just kind of called uh, the guys at uh, Island Spirit and I said, hey, our, our thingy's acting up. It's not acting great. So I said, okay, where are you? Where are you headed? And I told them where we were, where we're going. And uh, they sent out a boat to, we're just out here in the middle of the ocean. Uh, they just sent a guy to fix it. Kind of nice. The guys even did us a favor and took our trash away. It took us about three hours to leave the southern end of Koh Chong over to Koh Nam. It's such a beautiful spot coming up right here. Uh, really is gorgeous. The girls were about to get in the water when they saw a few jellyfish. There's another. I think maybe you can see it better. 
What is it? It's full. The tea is full with it. Let's stick your hand on it. See if it hurts. Do it. Do it. Are you doing it? Ah! No, I'm kidding. Oh. <laughs> I really believe you. No, it doesn't hurt. Where is it? Is it on I your don't hand? know. Maybe? I don't think it hurts. I mean, like, I don't. Well, yeah. Would you go in the water? <laughs> yeah, sure. Really? Yeah. <laughs> we got a new pet. Yeah, we got a jellyfish. That's the new sailing jellyfish. Nothing yet? Nothing? Nope. Nope. Ah, no, I'm kidding. I think I need a flower. <laughs> oh, I have a fish. So they are gonna kayak ashore. I will take the dinghy um, so that we can have like, well, take you with me and stuff like that. Uh, and we're gonna go check out this little resort down there. By the way, the cruising guide is really cool here. So this thing, uh, that Gulf Charters now, um, Island Spirit Group um, put this together and it is a cruising guide and it's really cool. It's actually Kim that did it. Kim, uh, you know, they went out and researched all these places and everything. It's just really awesome how well together this uh, cruising guide is. They have all the different anchorages. They tell you where to anchor, you know, what kind of depth you're gonna anchor in and all that kind of stuff. And then they give you all the cool stuff to do ashore. Uh, I mean, really well put together stuff. So, uh, Kim, uh, thank you so much. She's the kind of the charter base uh, manager for Island Spirit here. And uh, excellent job, excellent job, gotta say. So anyway, let's go ashore and uh, check out this little resort over here. Let's do this. All right, guys. So, how was your how was your experience? Your sale? It's almost over. We got less than twenty four hours left, and then we're uh, out of here. Hi. <laughs> My experience so nice. Yeah. We have been in a lot of um, wonderful places that you couldn't be if you are a tourist. That's true. That's definitely true. That's the thing is is uh, by traveling by sailboat is that that. Mm -hmm. You get to see a lot of places. I mean, like here, I mean, you, you can book a room here or something, you can come here, but then you stay here the whole time. Here we come here for yes. a few days. But, totally. you know, odds are you would never come to this place if you just came to Coach Hong, so it's kind of nice. That's true. Well, this might be a good spot for sunset. We'll see how it goes, so. Will we stay here overnight? Yeah. Nice, I like it. Yeah. I like the dedication. Yeah, it's our last night. It's pretty close to the base, and it's really pretty and scenic, so. Uh, we'll give it a shot. Mm -hmm. on getting a really cool pan out shot with a drone and then okay, stop. Turn off. Turn off. Turn off. Yeah. Jesus. Thankfully he didn't die. I got a little too close. It's alive. Thank you to our patrons. You can become a patron for as little as a dollar a week. And thank you to Group Island Spirit for letting us use this fantastic boat. Thank you so much for watching. Please click like and subscribe and check out one of our new flying doodles videos.